I'll tell the police what you've done to me. I'll tell them what you are. I'll tell them. I'll tell them. Hmm. Nice shooting in any league. A girl and a mirror all in one shot. Nick. You see what happened? It was an accident, wasn't it? Yeah. It was an accident. Who is it? Helen? She's been making a lot of trouble. What do you do now, Benny? Maybe you got a smart idea. Shall we uh, tell the police? That's bright. You think they'd believe it was an accident? <laughs> Not with your record, Benny. Suppose we don't tell the police and just keep it a secret between us, huh? That's better. I'll get your car out. Bring it around the alley entrance. Better make sure that none of her personal belongings are left around. I'll make sure. And, uh, Benny, maybe you can think up a little bonus for this night's work, huh? Sure. Homicide got on his mind this morning. Well, an old story, Captain. But one I never get used to. Hmm. Ah, pretty young. Get me file 472. Yes, sir. She couldn't be a day over 17. Oh, I forgot. Captain Webb, my new assistant, Sergeant Rennie. How did you do, sir? the Lieutenant Williams, you'll learn fast. <laughs> You're telling me. Here you are, sir. Well, that's just a child. You should be at home wearing your graduation dress. Fifteen years behind this desk, and still I don't get it. These girls, many of them talented, many of them from good families who would love and protect them, and still they run away to throw themselves on the mercy of the city. Which has no mercy. That dumb innocence, I tell you. 